Hello, this is Krillian, and welcome to episode 62 of my Let's Play, Total War uh, Attila, as the picks on Legendary Difficulty. We're being attacked at Narbo, where we will not fight with a large army, because that would be so pointless. Um, they have way more reserves than us, as their stacks are full. We have our pitiful stack, and then our relatively beat-up army. Um, we have lots of javelin men, and then spears. This is not great. They have swords. Uh, the goal is to hold the city, um, which is just a holding action as much as possible. We have like no cav, not till the very end. But we'll see what we can do. Uh, let's go ahead and fight this battle. Now, in the best case scenario, we just hold them at bay basically for the whole time. They're oh, we're pretty experienced too. I'm like, ah, oh, this is an experienced army. Um Javelins do a ton Oh no. Oh that's horrible. Narbo's a terrible city to defend. Okay, so we're probably gonna lose Narbo, just because there's no good defensive place at Narbo to defend. So, what we have to consider is how to do the most damage possible. They're lined up here, but for all I know, the reserves will all come from different areas. Okay, well, that sucks massively. Now there is the slope here, which is in the past where we have held the line. And I think it's what we're going to have to do this time, more or less. We hunger for blood and battle! Battle ready and eager! You come right there. Our spears are yours. You guys come right here. You have our spears. You guys come here. Spearmen ready for battle. You put yourself right there. Okay. That will give us. Our best chance, I think, is to just put ourselves along here and hope that we can get some stuff done. You are supposed to be here. Yep, fill in along this ridge. And, yeah, I think you're dead, dude, but... The other option is to make a break for the hill here. But then there were reserves that could literally come in from right behind us. But the higher ground, assuming they don't come in from directly behind us, they shouldn't. I mean, they should all be coming from the same direction. My reserve should be the other way. So we make a break for that mountain and fight on the higher ground. These towers can just do so much damage if we hold the area. They can also do a lot of damage to us. I think I'm gonna make a break for it. Well, that is true. We could actually set up on the ridge ahead of time. So if I wanted to do that instead, if I wanted to just... Put myself like this. Have you be there with you? I mean, we could be pre set up. Spearman. You from up there. We 
Let's just grab you. We hunger for blood and battle. Come there. Part of me really thinks this running over here would be better, but having the other army show up from behind would be the death nail. So you come there. Uh, we'll put a barrier here just to delay armies possibly coming from that side. It's my armies, they're just going to come up onto this mountain anyway, so... We hunger for blood and battle! I just don't think there's a good option in this city. Ever. Yeah. Well, if we lose the city, it's not the end of the world. This is not exactly an amazing stack, but now I have to remember that Narbo is a horrible place to defend. I think they just rebuilt Narbo, so I don't think I've fought here in this campaign, other than when I took it. So we'll just do this. Well. You guys come out to do some skirmishing. Our general is under attack! The men are losing hope! Wow, they didn't hold at all. The men have thrown down their weapons it was sword. and are fleeing! Yeah, oh. Just get in there because it's not going to matter. Our men have rallied! Get in there. Reinforcing troops, and not a moment too soon. The battle is no longer enough. Our men flee the field of battle. This you guys, get over here if you can. The men are broken and are fleeing. Good for them. Run away if you can. Don't die. A dark day. Our general has died at enemy hands. Yeah. Get you. So our army was coming in from here. Although those swords just cut my uh, spears to nothing. A tower has fallen. Hey, you got away. Good for you. I should be getting a lot more men eventually. And my hope is that they just kind of hang out in there and we can hide out in the forest. Should have ran my general away. Now these guys aren't actually... We're going to put ourselves here. Last! A fire has started among the houses! Now, the reason to stay here is because our backs are to the red line and we can run off. Because I expect this to go bad. I would actually just retreat this whole army if I can, because they're. they are coming. Get in there.
Damn! Our ambush troops have been detected! Oh. Look! They're hidden! We're being ambushed! Our men flee the field of battle! This is a shameful display! You guys search for Yeah, they are. Can't say I blame them. One of our units has gone berserk! You... Get over here. The general here. is dead! A lethal blow! That's good. Well, funds come clean the center point. The men are broken and are fleeing! The men have thrown down their weapons and are fleeing! I need you to die. Our men have given up and are running for their lives! The men are losing faith! My general's dead, apparently. The enemy has obliterated an entire unit! Okay, I think enough will have gone off. You just run for here. Get out. I don't know if that was a valiant defeat. That was horrible. This is the... W I hate this settlement. It is the worst settlement imaginable. We, they lost so little compared to us. If we'd had a decent defensible settlement, we could have actually had a chance. All these swordsmen are, are really good. Anyone that kills over 300, and, even if they're fighting, you know, basic spearmen, these are tier 2 spearmen, I mean still. That's pretty good. Okay, well we're gonna loot, we're gonna probably just sack it. We'll see. We'll be back in a moment. Okay. Most of your army did get away. Well, the spears did. And... Retreat! Gathering supplies. I did not think all of those armies would get there. We did not do as much damage as I had hoped. You know, if they move beyond my line of sight, for well, like, you think they keep moving. They went down here, and apparently they stopped right here. Because they went here, and then managed to get all the way to Narbo. That seems... further than I could march. Okay, so we have one stack over here. Three this way. One of which got a little damaged, the other two not really. Let's see, this one looks under. That one's the one that was damaged. My lord offers you peace. Yes. His prayer. One peace with someone, for goodness sake. Because I am fighting the world. Including Hispania. And Anatolia. And almost everyone else. Okay. Sure, we'll pick you. Lots of fossil agents. Oh, we lost some offices. Okay. Ready for battle. Thirsty for battle. Buy what you can. Huh. 
ready for battle. For the tribe. Can you get out of that? Ready for orders. Okay. Thirsty for battle. Come to there. Come to there. Get moving. Fleet ready. You're good where you are. You. I'm tempted to drop you all the way back to Ludinum. For the tribe. Now this is a walled settlement. Huh. They left me Narbo, which is a bit odd. What are the armies do I have around? You guys are taking this. You're a navy, right? No, you're an army. You're just at sea for some reason. Getting on our way! Okay, you could take Tarentum. You step into Neapolis. You, I need. Will be left behind. Oh wait, you. For battle. Take what you can. Start raiding. Thirsty for battle. Get out of forest march. That thing can I help you? Since you seem to get as far one way or the other. Do I just want to leave you in Rome then? <laughs> Repair all this stuff. You could come and repopulate this region. That would not be a bad idea. Wait, don't do that. Knock that down. Neopolis is a walled settlement. What is my garrison there? Oh, well, that's going to be a pretty cool garrison in a few turns. We have to leave someone there for now. Ready for battle! Let them cower before us! Yes, colonize it. Ready for orders! For the tribe! Got us past the river. We'll build that. Public order here is horrible. Um. Don't tax this region. Why is it so bad? Food is 15, that'll go away. Spility will go down. We'll deal with religious differences soon enough. It is what it is. Okay, you, how many turns do you need? Two? Or three. Do I want you guys to be in the walled settlement? I really wish I knew what the settlement type was. It's walled, so it has to be better than what we were doing. It can't be that one. You have crossbows, which should wreak havoc and a thing. We're going to put you in the city. You? This area is still good. I 
I'm pulling you all the way back to looting them. You guys got too wrecked, and I need you to to get better troops. Thirsty for battle, ready for battle. Um. Buy that, and that, and that, and then. Recruit a spear. I don't really like those swords. Okay. So, if they come at me at Aquae Sextai, you are a pretty decent stack into a walled settlement. This army is wrecked. I think we have a decent chance of defending Aquae Sextai. Not sure if I'd let them. I may just let them come in at once because crossbows and whatnot into a big mob do wonders. Okay. I am the knife in the dark. You can't do that. Yes. You. I need to see what's going on here. There is more I could do. Okay. So these are basically everything that they have. Well, they may have some more further south, but the what I see so far is useless stuff. You can hit Genoa. Oh, if you do, you do. Let's end the turn. You guys. You have that one. You are my admiral. I uh, get some integrity. Uh, get that one. Then we go ahead and end our turn. We have more armies. Oh, I should have checked. Thought about looking to see where my other armies were, but it's fine. I was mainly looking at how to outmaneuver the Geats armies so that I can fight with maximum efficiency and they cannot bring four stacks against me. So that is a supremely important thing. We're getting a ton of money from raiding that one region. So we're just going to sit there and raid that for the foreseeable future. Neopolis should be able to defend itself in a few turns. Lots of Agent actions, it is what it is, though. I wonder if Avarikum can build better troops. I may have to check and bring this guy over to Avarikum and give it some of the, you know, useless stuff he's built. Will they attack us at Aqua Sextai? Nope, they're coming the other way. But we can retreat. They're not going to be able to catch us. And... No, they didn't. Oh, that's amazing. Because we have the ability to do night attacks. Which are stunningly good for us and not great for them. Although they did put their strongest army in the front. I am not putting an army in Narbo. Oh, they're going for it. I thought that I was going to leave Genoa open there. <sighs> I really don't think I can win, but I can do a lot of damage, and so I kind of have to fight this. So we're going to go ahead and manually fight this one. Well, let me... What settlement? Is this Narbo-like? We're not bothering. If it's some of the other ones, it is. Okay, we have a, a great defensive ground. Uh, we're going to fight this manually, and uh, 
these are pretty much chaff units. If we kill, if the general dies quickly, running into our spears, they may not stand and fight very long. So, let's do it. Uh, we're gonna pause the video. We'll be back. Okay, they're attacking us in a horrible weather because why wouldn't they? Can I put you guys in this area? No. Okay, we have some cav over there. You be over here because I don't want you to fight. Come on. That works. Both of you just go to give that. You hang back here. You. Come on. It may be raining, but you guys can form up. That's fine. I guess. The, you guys are going to wait to see what happens with them, and then we'll do this. Um, we're going to build that, because if they land here and they come running around and we make them run away, we'll drop our guys on there. Okay, you go to start the battle. You come into the forest. By the bears, No, the question is, do they just go around my little wall? Kill the general. That would be amazingly hilarious. Okay, they're doing what we want, which is to charge right at our guys. Finding out that it sucks to be horses going into a spear wall. We have gained the upper hand! No, we haven't. Don't be hilarious. Enemy units have been rallied! The enemy general is fallen! Okay. Our men flee the field of battle! Which is dumb. Is a shameful display! No. What are you doing? Our men run from the enemy! This is shameful! Oh my goodness. A unit is running from the enemy! Really? They, there's nowhere in the area that they can land? Uh, it's the men dark. are losing faith! The tower has been totally destroyed! Okay, those generals did way more damage to my spear unit than I thought they would. Which... is very poor. Okay, you're gonna frenzy and charge downhill at them. Cause that's basically all I got. They're shaken. You should kinda of, these are desert spears. I mean they really do suck, but there's just way too many of them. One of our units has used all its ammunition! You guys run back here. Can you hold long enough for my guy to come in from the rear? Probably not. All your spears. Do all the damage we can. You. 
you killed them. One of our units can no longer fire! Come into here. If we get a mass route going, I'll kill these 92, I guess. The men are broken and running for their lives! You frenzy again. An entire unit has perished. It happens. Again, didn't really expect to win this one. Just wanted to do extra damage. And that I am positive that we have succeeded in. You guys come fire at this guy. The men's resolve is failing! The enemy has obliterated an entire unit! This means they fought to a man. Okay, you guys. Come up here. You're gonna mock them. Try to distract them some with my cap. How are they going faster than my? The enemy are ambushing us! No, they're not. My restricted freaking camera is not letting me get to where my troops are. Seems to break the point of the restricted camera. Faint and run. Faint and run. You come over here. Hidden units! Watch out! Get around them. I'm being dragged by the restricted camera, and not necessarily to where my troops are. A unit has fired all of its ammunition! Well, that's poor. The men have broken and are fleeing! Okay, well, we did as much as we could. And our troops got away unhurt. Decisive defeat. I am amazed that my cav... How did they kill so many people? These guys didn't fight my spears. I mean, these four fought my spears and they killed 27 and, what, 27, 36, 51? 
Why did two units of spirits break if only 51 of them died? I mean, it's like accrediting these guys with all those skills. What the heck happened? That's very weird. We killed tons of them, but I don't know if we did enough. Oh well, we'll pause the video, we'll be right back. And of course, let us back the moment we finish pausing. Uh, we killed one of the spear units, not terrible. Two of the three cav. And put a wrecking on several others. Do you conquer the region? Because I really wish you would. Nope, of course you don't. Uh, we have an army to plant in Genoa and cut, get this stuff back under order. Does Hispania hit it too? Oh no, yay, Hispania fought them. That was awesome. As long as our strength remains, we would be honored to count you as friends and more. No, you're just going to drag me somehow into more wars. I, I refuse. Oh, I hit the minor victory. Cool, continue the campaign. As for the major victory, we need how much more? Uh, another five, six turns of raiding that region. Okay. You come sit in Genoa. If you had been there, we would have won. They probably wouldn't have even attacked. They'd have been like, yeah, attacking here is dumb. Why are we still at negative 11? Banditry? Who's banditry are we dealing with? I mean, we're in their region doing banditry, which is incredibly happy. You are fully in their region, right? Hmm. Okay, uh, we're actually going to end the episode here. Before we continue on too much further, um, we may have to move that guy a little bit further to the next time, but I, I think I'm going to be out of time to do another episode today. So like and subscribe if you have any questions or comments. Feel free to leave them below. Um, uh, we lost a dude to natural causes. That was our spy. Okay. So for now, oh, we didn't do our offices either. Oh well, like and subscribe, we'll be back next time. For now, adios.